Hi everyone, welcome to my video. Today it's 3 degrees of purple. I'm showing you how to rock purple lips. 3 ways from the sheerest, medium tone to the very dark. And I hope you enjoyed the video and you'll learn a little something or two. So stay tuned. So the first one we're going to do is going to be um, the lightest of the three. Um, very nice purple lip that you can use every day. Two items. I have my Vinyl Jelly Gloss Lip Liner from Rimmel and I have it in Tasty. And I have from Avon the Totally Kissable Lip Gloss and it is in Plum Bitten. It's, it looks in the light. It is not as dark as it looks but it's such a pretty purple. Sorry, if you don't want your purple to be too purple or too intense, you can always do a pink liner to just give it more pink. And this is the lip gloss. So the second lip I'm going to need a lip line in traditional scent and I'm always going to be using my friend from Black Opal in Timber. And I'm going to be using Black Opal lipstick because their lipsticks are really really great. And this one I'm using here, let's see if you get it, this is Fantasia Plum and it is a beautiful color so and I'm using another brush because it's a darker color and I need to a little more precision uh, this is Fantasia Plum The last color that I'll be showing you is also from Black Opal and it's called <coughs> it's called <coughs> it's called Ebony Wine and it's the darkest purple that I've ever seen. It's close to black. So this one right here, Ebony Wine. This is Fantasia Plum, this is Ebony Wine. There's an in-between color called Wine Knot. Um, I actually have this one up on my Instagram and my Facebook of the color. It's more of a um, has a reddish undertone. So I'm going to use this one here, Ebony Wine. And the darker the lipsticks are, the more precise you have to be with your application. So I like to use an eyeliner brush. This is a thicker one. This is one from Sigma. And so I have a lot more control in terms of doing the outline so it looks a little more, it looks crisper. Okay, so this is it, and it's more like a, a grayish purple, like it's a really deep purple with a gray undertone, like it's very, very dark and vampy, and I like it. <laughs> I like it. I do, I actually do like it. Okay, so that's it for the video today, three degrees of purple, so you saw from the lightest, sheerest purple, to a really rich intense purple to a very dark gray based purple and I hope you um, enjoyed the video um, please thumbs it up and please comment and please share it because a lot of people have difficulties in um, applying purple lips and it's something very nice to look at but some people kind of shy away from it I think it works for every tone of skin it looks really however very um, I think the most beautiful in the darker skin that you have um, and if you're wondering what kind of blush to pair it with and what kind of face, I just kept my face really um, natural looking like I used um, Numeralized Skin Finish from MAC in deep, in dark deep and I used a purple blush for my cheeks and this was the one from Sasha, Perfect Wendy 2 and I think it's actually just very perfect um, to complement 
any lipstick but especially purple ones um, and that's about it um, and I kept my eyes really neutral of course I'm wearing a hat but I kept my eyes really neutral just lashes and liner that's that <laughs> so thanks so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed it and learned something <laughs>